these the right boxes? Is that the right one? This is the same ones I ordered before. So you'll see this number on the bottom, Josh. That'll be the bottom. So fold the sides in first, then fold these down. Were you putting the, this stuff on there? I'd, uh, I'd put one of these in the middle, line this up like this, just to keep it, keep it closed on you here. Put that on like that. Then come in with this tape. It's freaking taped itself to the dispenser. Big shipping guy. Oh yeah. What the heck? No. Oh. Oh, the freaking noise is coming out of you. Okay. You shouldn't have to worry about that. Look at it. It took the paint off it. Somebody taped it on there and then sucked it back. You don't ever tape onto the dispenser. Look at that. You wow, see that? I've never seen that before. It, well, of course, that's the only chunk of paint on the thing. It just ripped it all completely off. Yeah, it's some good dick. Jeez. So back to what I was saying here, Josh. Getting these boxes done so that we can get those weld-it-yourself trike frames shipped out. Got all these parts that Josh made the other day. Dragon is just spitting fire cutting out parts got the ghost cart getting powdered today so got some parts and pieces here that got all cleaned up ready to go more parts josh has ready to go so we're going to static red with this it's a color we've used on a bunch of the trikes looks really good pops it's nice and bright eye catching so this is ready to get shot with the base coat we'll bake it clear coat it, then start assembly. If, uh, for you guys that are OG subscribers that really follow along, you'll notice that that frame's a little bit different. Uh, we got quite the surprise in store for you, so. We're really excited about that. Yeah. Not quite the surprise for you quite guys. Quite the surprise for you guys, so. You got a little bourbon in that coffee? I'm on, I'm on about 40 ounces of coffee, freaking pound and a half of powder and a freaking dream and I'm ready to go. <laughs> two. Take two. All right, guys. So we're going to get back to uh, what we were doing before giving away a free t-shirt because we appreciate you guys. What were we doing before? Like all oh, the first person to say like, uh, Fluffy slippers. uh, peanut butter in your, uh, in your slippers is no fun. First person to comment peanut butter in your slippers is no fun gets a uh, t-shirt. So, um, and maybe you have a patch. We'll see if we have extra patches. So we got to get to uh, powder coat in this thing because Sir Monster, he's getting a little bit uh, antsy. He's wondering where it's at. What do you think? Probably should use the new powder. Probably. Stuff's probably older than six months. So. It's like, it's like two different layers in it. So, whenever your powder looks like this, and you can go like that, it's got too much moisture in it. It's just too old. It's kind of like, it's not going to spray right. So, like see how it's clumping and stuff? Yeah. You could shake it up, but I really don't want to chance it. Where like, if you look at something like, I know this stuff's fresh here. Like it'll almost look like, see how it's just all, what's that sand? Like that, uh, they have like that special sand that's almost like, I forget what they call it, but you can just kind of tell whenever it's no good anymore. So, I don't really want to chance it. Don't chance it. All clumped up. I don't, want any, don't want any uh, imperfections. I'm sure if you shake it, probably... Yeah, it's tempting. That's why I found it. Like that fluid sand. I don't know. Hate to open up another one when we already have powder, but. So we did decide to go with the, 
the new stuff I just ordered. That other stuff would have been fine. But we'll use the new stuff in this one. That's about it. A couple spots we had to hit again. There's a bunch of welds and it's kind of hard to get in all the spots, but got it. Gonna bake it, let it come out, let it cool, do the clear coat on it, and then be ready to assemble.